Hey guys, did I scare ya? Welcome to Moon Cat Studios, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to draw a super easy cat. Um, this works well if you're making like a Warrior Cats OC, or you know, if you just like cats in general. This is a super super easy drawing and super fun. And once you get the hang of it, you're probably going to be drawing a ton of cats. I drew an entire Warrior Cats clan over the course of a few weeks. I would not recommend doing that just because now I have a bunch of random warrior cats drawings that I don't know what to do with. But anyway, let's get started. So the first thing you're going to do is draw a circle for your cat's head, and you want to do that pretty lightly so you can erase it or adjust it if you need to. Then you're going to do a curved line like this. Kind of act like you're making a heart shape because you're going to do another one on the other side. And then you're going to draw your cat's paws. That's just three little bumps like this. And three little bumps like this. And then you're going to make the cat's hind legs, which is kind of the same shape, except the back paws are a little longer. Add a tail, or if your cat has a very short tail or no tail, then you don't have to do this step. You can also draw your cat's tail curling around its paws, which is a very cute look. And then you're going to do your cat's face. So the reason I had you draw the face more lightly is so that you can do different like head shapes or cheek shapes. Like I like to give my cats fluffier cheeks. And then you're going to go ahead and erase however you need. Get rid of those eraser shavings there. Then add your cat's ears. And you can play around with your cat's ear shape. Like you can do... larger ears or you could do like if you want a character who's like a battle hero I drew that head completely crooked but you could even do like a ripped ear or a torn ear you can just play around with it however you want I drew this cat She's my current favorite OC I've made. Her name is Minnow Splash, and I did, like, really big, oversized ears for her. She's kind of my favorite. But, yeah, you can do, like, whatever you want here. You can even give your cat rounder, like, bear-like ears. But anyway, back to the thing we were doing here. You can also make sure you draw your cat's inner ear. You can also draw some hair in the inner ear if you want to add a little detail. And then you can do your face. And again, the face is where you can have like the most fun. You can do like more slitted eyes like this. You can do kawaii eyes. Okay, you know what? I think I'm gonna go completely kawaii here. So if you're in the mood to do this, you can also do like a super innocent cutesy look for the eyes. So I don't even know what this is. Is this a kit? Is this a warrior? Or is this just a normal cat? No one knows. You can do a smile, you can do a surprise mouth. I think I'll do a smile. And a wink. And some people don't like to draw eyebrows on animals, but I kinda do. So I'm gonna show you some of my other drawings so you can see the amount of variety you can have. Um. And maybe help you get your own ideas for cats. You can see like another drawing I did ghosting through on the other side. But yeah, these are just a couple of the cats I've drawn. I love her. She is so sassy. Um, so yeah. And then I think I have some kits on the other side. Just a second. Yes. So I have the kits here. Kits are super easy to draw. You just do a normal cat. But give them like chubbier features, larger ears, more innocent faces. 
Oh yeah, here's my classy handwriting where I wrote like who the kid's parents are and stuff. Here's a mystery. Parents on that one. So anyway, that is how to draw your very own super simple cat. I will see you in my next video. Thank you for watching and um I'm trying to think of like an inspiring quote. Not all who wander are lost. That's my favorite quote. So yeah. Bye everyone.